Now let's look at a problem that involves e and natural log. Because I have an e in the problem, I remember that, oh yeah, I'm going to have to use natural log to eliminate the e. But first of all, let's get rid of the 8. We'll divide both sides by 8, and the fraction 20 over 8 will reduce nicely to 5 over 2. So now I have e to the 2x power equal to 5 over 2. So remember, to get rid of e, I'm going to apply the natural log to both sides of my equation. When I do that, the natural log and the e, which are inverses of each other, disappear on the left-hand side, and that 2x as a power drops down to be just a normal 2x. So now I have 2x equal to the natural log of the fraction 5 over 2. I'm going to get the x totally alone by dividing both sides by 2, and when I type that into my calculator, I should get that x is approximately 0.458.